Have you ever wondered why specialist TV programs are seldom made? Programs like Schoenberg's cabaret songs, the children's ballet series Dance Tales, and on specialist crafts like bookbinding. Programs like these are considered uncommercial and seldom produced as they are time consuming and expensive. Fortunately, today, modern technology means that anyone can make and market TV programs, movies and documentaries. All one has to have is a passion to share your subject with the world, a DV camcorder, home computer, time and the basic skills to make your program watchable. Most commercial TV programs and films are aimed at the 29-year-old male, as this is what production companies believe is their most lucrative market. All their products are aimed at them. Think about it. That's fine if you are a 29-year-old average male who likes professional wrestling, motor cars, sex, violence, sport and computer games, but not so good if you like opera, ballet, bookbinding and croquet. Up until now there has been little for you to watch or buy and women have come off especially badly. Over the past few years, all has changed. Today, anyone who is passionate about television or film can make acceptable quality television or video movies at home using just the basic edit program on a home computer and an ordinary DV camcorder. Your DVDs can be sold to the world via CreateSpace DVD On Demand and Amazon.com why give all your talent and knowledge away when you can make a DVD to download and sell? And you can tell the world about them on YouTube. So now the world is your oyster. Today there are many subjects of social history that could and should be filmed for posterity. And with a little time and effort, anyone can do it. Virtually everyone has a story to tell or a skill to pass on. The Cabaret Songs and Erwartung by Arnold Scherberg are good examples of social history. They show what was being produced in Auckland by a group of young professional singers and dancers in the 1980s. Against all odds and with very little money, these intrepid performing artists produced some exceptional performances which are still acceptable today. No government grants meant the establishment took little notice. They were airbrushed out of history. But the evidence of one's eyes proves just how special this group of artists were. But for the fact they were videoed as keepsake, their brilliance would have been lost and the world would be poorer. I find the experience of making my own TV program so enjoyable that I have made a short DVD showing how you can do it yourself at home using just a basic edit program and an ordinary DV camcorder. It is surprisingly easy to do, much easier than you think, and once learnt the possibilities and opportunities to share one's life's passion, interest, life story are endless. If you can write an email, you can make a TV program. I had to learn how to do it from scratch. I needed to know about lighting, camera angles and shots, sound, editing, and generally how to put the show together. Getting started making a movie is a big learning curve, unless there is someone who will show you the basics quickly and painlessly. I persevered and now find the experience so easy that I want others to be able to do the same but without the horrible learning curve. Hence, Do It Yourself TV, learn TV and movie production in 44 minutes, where I do everything myself to show that anyone can do it. The basics of film production can be taught in less than an hour. Well, 44 minutes to be exact. This knowledge will get you started, and from there on, the sky is the limit. Okay, I'm not Oprah Winfrey, and my accent may be a bit annoying, and I am a mature woman, but the knowledge you will need is all there. In 44 minutes, you can learn what it took me a lifetime. 
You do not need expensive film schools or years of training, just the basics. So I hope you will be inspired to make live CVs and items for YouTube, as well as sharing your passion with the world in full-scale documentaries that I can download and enjoy. Let's make the world a more interesting place for all, not only the 29-year-old male. <laughs>